Thanks to breakthroughs in Soviet aviation, your military advisor estimates a delivery in 10 minutes. Oh, I guess we should get on the phone to the president then. Your last hope of preventing Armageddon is to get the US Army to intercept the plane. The time to call the president. To intercept the plane? It's not... You haven't shot a warhead. You've got a warhead on a plane. Why don't you just phone your own fucking plane? I know, 999? Washington Moscow hotline. Thank you for your call. Are you calling about an urgent matter and would you like a direct line with the president? Yes. Press one. In order for us to connect you to the president, we will need a verification code. Please enter your six digit identification code and close with pound. One, two, three, four, five, six. Pound. That was not the right code, or you may not have the clearance to contact the president. Damn it. Please, enter your Washington Moscow hotline verification code again and close with pound. Well, I can't turn around, so, uh... That was not the right code. I didn't press anything! Clearance to contact the president. Yep. That was not the right code. Would you like to try again? Press 1. If you would like to return to the main menu, press 2. Hi. You have reached the United States Washington Moscow hotline. Thank you for your call. Are you calling about an urgent matter and would you like a direct line with the president? Nah, it's, it's just press war. One. It's just war. If your matter is less urgent and you would like to speak to a representative, press 2. For other matters, press 3. We value your call. A representative will speak with you shortly. You are 14th in line. <laughs> Expected wait time is 34 minutes. Bullshit. Our wait times are unusually high right now. It might be best to try again at another time. Would you like to continue waiting? Press 1. If you would like to go back to the main menu, press 2. Hi. You have reached the United States Washington Moscow hotline. I press 3 to speak Thank to rip other guy. Are you calling about an urgent matter, and would you like a direct If you're calling about renewing trade accords with the White House, press 1. If you're calling about our nuclear program, press 2. If you're calling about applying for a Washington Moscow hotline verification code, press yes. reminder for your verification code, press 3. To apply for Washington Moscow hotline verification code, press 1. For a reminder of your verification code, press 2. Please enter your three-digit reminder key and close with pound to get a reminder for your verification code. Fuck. That was not the right code. Would you like to try again? Press 1. To return to the main menu. Hi. You have reached the United States Washington Moscow hotline. Thank you for your call. Are you calling about an urgent matter? And if you're calling about renewing trade accords with the White House, press 1. To apply for Washington Moscow hotline verification code, press 1. To apply for a new verification code, we need to know if you are a low-ranking or high-ranking official. If you are low-ranking, press 1. If you are high-ranking, press 2. What is your function? If you are head of defense, press 1. If you are head of international relations, press 2. If you are president, king, or chairman of your nation, press 3. 
Thank you for applying for a Washington Moscow hotline verification code. Your code is 034678. To return to the main menu, press 0. Hi. You have reached the United States Washington Moscow hotline. Thank you for your call. In order for us to connect you to the yeah. Place, we will need a verification code. Okay. Please enter your six digit identification code and close with pound. That was not the right code, or you may not have the clearance to contact the president. That was not the right code. Would you like to try it again? No. In order for us to connect you to the president, we will need a verification code. Please enter your six digit identification code and close with pound. Oh, three, four, five. Mm, mm. I'm pretty sure this is what I was given. Right Fuck. Main menu. To contact the president. Please enter your Washington Moscow hotline verification code again and close with pound. That was not the right code. Would you like to try again? No. Press one. If you would like to return to the main menu. You have reached the United States Washington Moscow hotline. Mm -hmm. If you're calling about renewing trade accords with the White House, press one. Come on. To apply for Washington Moscow hotline. To apply for a new verification code, we need to know if you are a low ranking or high ranking official. <laughs> what is your function? I guess maybe I should select king here. Press one. In order to grant you a Washington Moscow hotline verification code, we need to confirm you are not a robot. Please type the following code, one, four, six, two, and close with the pound key. Thank you for applying for a Washington Moscow hotline verification code. Your code is four. Four, five, seven, eight, three. To get a reminder of your code, use your reminder key, which is one, three, three. To return to the. Thank you for applying for a Washington Moscow hotline verification code. Your code is four, four, five, seven, eight. Three. To get yeah. A reminder of your code. Use your reminder key, which is one, three, three. To return to the main menu, press zero. Zero now, not two. You have reached the United States Washington Moscow hotline. Thank you for your call. Bro, they're not going to have any time to scramble jets for this plane. In order for us to connect you to the president, we will need a verification code. Please enter your six digit identification code and close with pound. Thank you for inputting your verification code. Welcome back, Chairman Lankoff. We will now redirect you to the president. Please wait. Mm. Unfortunately, the president is out of office at this time. Fuck. Would you like to book an appointment? Press 1. Is there an emergency that cannot wait? Press 2. Understood. We are dedicated to helping you out with your emergency. Can you tell us more about what type of emergency you're experiencing? Is the nature of your emergency economic? Press 1. Is the nature of your emergency related to nuclear war? Press 2. We are very concerned to hear you are experiencing an emergency regarding nuclear war and <laughs> very seriously. To help us understand the problem, can you tell us if your emergency endangers U.S. soil or not? <laughs> if yes, press 1. 
Nuclear emergencies that threaten U.S. territory is a very important issue. Is it possible that you may have accidentally targeted the United States and need help with intercepting a missile? Yeah! If yes, press 1. Did you know you can order a special interception military mission from this menu? In order to military special permission code that aligns with the type of ballistic... <laughs> Damn. Moaning noises. Psst. Science sucks. It should be able to make me into a mermaid already. Uh, okay. The void this fine comes. Wow. Um, game a moment. Making my cyber arm into a vibrator was the best fucking decision I ever made. <laughs> I need to buy more bath bombs. I need a glass of wine. I should get out, but then life has to resume. Fuck, I forgot the dildo. Just saying the same things over and over again. Well, okay. That sure was an experience. Sounds? Okay, we sort of got sounds. Broomstick unprompted W and S up and down. Greetings to you. Which saleswoman did just set up shop here? So I'm gonna get some more sound. Thanks. Yep, what can I do for you today? See, I love the taste of flies. Delectable, really. Have I recently learned about the cruelty of fly-keeping industry, the horror? I've immediately henceforth started today to decide to go vegan. Never again will I eat fly. Anyway, I was wondering if you would mayhaps be able to craft a charming concoction to make my cereal taste like flies. What a coincidence, I have the exact thing you need. Head to the lectern to try and find a recipe for a potion to suit this man's needs. This man. Alright, the curse is on the screen. Leave it. When reading the recipe book, press left and right to flip between the different pages. Press E to stop reading. Potion of vocal exercises. Potion of wizardry. Potion of taste like fly. Made from the plant that loves to chew. No flies are harmed in making this brew. One ingredient. Uh, okay. Stuck. Try bringing an ingredient to the customer. They may comment on it and can sometimes provide helpful clues. Uh, okay, don't know what you are. The plant that chews. It would be you, my trap. Thanks. Three ingredients in the cauldron, one based on each category, plant-based, creature-based, space-based. Ingredients of the same type are next to each other, don't worry. Some potions require specific temperatures, you can change the cauldron heat by pressing E. Just press E. Uh, if you want to dispose of the potion, bring it to the friendly trash toad and he'll gobble it right up. Very thoughtful. Here you go. He loves it. This potion it smells exactly like flies. Are you sure it's vegan? All natural ingredients, fresh in the greenhouse. Perfect. You know, you could be a business juggernaut with skills like that. I'll tell you what. I'll pull some strings, use some of my connections. Maybe see if we can't get this lovely little potion shop on the map. I'm off to eat my cereal. I mean, payment would be nice. Oh well. It's the end of the day. Head to bed to get a good night's sleep, ready for more customers tomorrow. I will do that. Where's the bed? Oh, seriously, where is the bed? Here it is. It's got a big frog bean bag. Kitty cushion for a lumbar. Uh, a Titanic movie poster. E.T. Random moon. Go, go, bed. Head downstairs to see if any customers have visited. I will do this. It's you again. Another request. What can I do? 
consider myself something of an incredible vocalist. My croaks have been known worldwide, and I want them to be even better. Have you tried singing lessons? Singing lessons charge. You don't. Yeah, about that. I'm sure this frog could afford them, but sure, I'll help. Head to the lectern yet. Yeah. Wasn't this like the very first one? Get the plant that screams like a choir. Take a melody straight from the stars, mix the ingredients together like a song, play the key as high as it can go. A plant that screams like a choir. Assumption. Take it to the guy. If that thing starts screaming, I will leave. My delicate in it is, can I take some much? Okay, and a, something straight from the stars? A melody straight from the stars. A melody. Stardust, black hole, a meteorite. Is that right? Yeah, it's right, okay. It was just slithering about, so it might, it might be a slug. Uh, is that a clam? No, it's a bag of stardust. Oh, like dust straight from the stars? Straight from the stars? Straight from the stars? Okay. Play the key as high as it can go. this. Here you go. The music to my ears, the bubbles bounce and burst in beautiful ballads. It's a make I have to run off to my singing recital, but I'm sure I'll be sure to thank you in my Grammy acceptance speech. This this guy just strutting out without paying. Two stars? Maybe it's just a screensaver. So if we're going to do this laundry... Straw but... Yeah, of course he's up shop here. Been looking for a magical mentor. Do you think you could help? I'm not super experienced in spell casting. Maybe I could try and brew you a potion. Alright, there's literally only three. Open your third eye and look what you need. A plant that grows up high and the leftovers after a star dies. When cooking it up, be sure to keep the heat light. Right, open your eye. The E, thanks. Keep it light. Plant that grows up high. Magic bean. In stalk. And things that's left behind after a star dies. Uh, e right, black hole. Can we both? After a star dies. The... A black hole left after a star dies? As you can start quick, make a wish. Are you going to tell me what you wish for? This probably isn't it. Yeah. Drop ingredient Q. There you go. The remnants of a supernova. Okay. Yes, this would be it then. There you go. This is magical. I could be a natural magician with this. Really glad it walked out. I believe you'll be an amazing mage someday. That's it. No, no one's got any money. There's no money in magic. Three stars. Four exposure. Right, 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 right. Which direction is the sky? Which direction is Earth? That looks like Earth. Am I looking at the size of a cube here? It's been a long time since I've been home. Will I recognize it? Who am I? Okay, I'm this guy. So many forms, so much to declare. Let's go through this section, I guess. Also, how's it rude? I didn't personally laugh at the guy. I didn't jump in his chat and be like, ah, you're shit. Big transitions have always, are always rough for me, despite having had so many. Sometimes I even convince myself that I've somehow arrived in the wrong place. But I don't actually know anyone here. 
Zoop. I suppose off to you is moving every few months and viewing most people in my life is temporary. That fear makes sense. I'm going to go and talk to the yellow person because I don't trust other races. Welcome to Taiwan. Oh, they're ignoring me. I see how it is. I was right in my assumptions. I don't have many belongings these days anyway. I did bring a sun hat, though. Auntie would kill me otherwise. Uh, yeah, you gotta pick this shop or not. I only bought a carry-on. August is so hot that you can only wear tank tops and sweat. The only superstition that stuck with me, I didn't pack a swimsuit. It's a ghost month after all. Airport line to Taipei main station. Train departing in one minute. Move your bollocks. I'm blue now. Oh, dabba dee dabba doi. What happened? Wait, what? Damn, wow. You, you're just walking through here and then like you saw the forest and shit. Damn, I wasn't expecting such artsy heaviness for a game that's like 4-bit. I'm gonna go to the dot. Yeah, we're at the dot now. Huh? 8 p.m. I thought I landed at half 10. Maybe I'm dehydrated. Oh, new cocoa. God, I haven't had good bubble tea in ages. Give me product now. What drink did you like? Here you go, enjoy. Green tea yakul. I don't know. Beep, beep, boop. Beep, boop, error. Do you know how these ticket machines work? Ayo, kids these days. Boomers in their AOs. The time it's 8 p.m. There's a clock right there, you dumb asshole. Blue line to place in question. Train departing in seven minutes. Red line. Taipei. Train departing three minutes. I guess I'll hit this way since the name of the game has Taipei in it. Fucking fine. Okay, oh, I gotta figure it out. What is that out there? It's the whole world. Cell phone etiquette. Send a text message instead. Keep phone calls brief. Speak softly. You're not the boss of me. Chiang Kai-shek Memorial Hall Station. Train departing at some time I didn't read. Is this some kind of light show? Where is everyone? Oh man, this is where WK and I fell off our bikes. Wow, that was three years ago now. It was the last night of my first time living in Taiwan on my own. We picked up U-bikes outside the barn. Zimen. <laughs> Zimen. I'm not losing my mind whatsoever. No way. Blah blah blah, found this also here, W and K, who were in Taiwan for the first time, were so in awe that they stopped looking where they were going and ran into each other. I laughed so hard that I fell off my bike too. We lay in silence on the ground, taking in the place in. I'd been here so many times I forgot how beautiful it was. No, I don't need to read it again. Bollocks. Why? Were you expecting action or something? It was after midnight, but we managed to buy some... Dumplings! Earlier, just before the place closed. In that moment, nothing had ever tasted so good. Yum, 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 yum. Oh, got another hater. Look at you people. Where's Princess Peach? Where's Mario? Where's Mega Man? Where's the ginger cat? The sky was orange and smog and city lights, but a couple of stars are visible. W and I got in some silly argument about whether astronomy contributed anything to society. I don't think I even cared that much about it. I was just an 18 year old trying to show that I had something to defend. After an hour, a security guard told us to fuck off and we rode back to our hostel. He's in another game. I actually have no idea where they are now. We worked together every day in that summer. But that was the last night we ever spoke. 
Damn. That's so real, you know? Like, people, people are, like, there. And then, like, they're not there. Fuck, that's heavy. The number of times I've run up these steps, pretending to be Rocky. Right, I guess that's Taipei flag, leg, and a gun? Dad used to take us with him to his kickboxing classes on the plaza every week. My siblings and I were too young to join in, so he had tried to copy them from the steps above, jumping and kicking the air or trying to run sideways against the wall. Cool. The first time we went, I think I was ten, I assumed the kickboxing class was an extension of the changing of the guard ceremonies that happened during the day. Every hour, uniformed soldiers carrying rifles taller than they were marched in formation as they switched shifts in front of the Chiang Kai-shek statue. What were they protecting? Who was there to fight? The Chinese. I am curious about new things. Do I hate life? What the fuck? He sounds like the people who complain about Radiohead being some miserable suicide soundtrack band. At the time, I might have known a little bit about the war that birthed this iteration of Taiwan. I didn't know yet that, to some people, that war never ended. Wonder if the class is still going on. It would be starting around now. You mean the kickboxing class? No, fuck off. Get, 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 the, get the fuck back! I was having an experience and I'm stuck in a fucking train station. Wait, oh hey, what's up? Shh, don't you see the sign? Old man, fine, don't talk to me. I don't even know where the fuck I'm going now. I guess go into the R. half-eaten TRA bento box. Someone must have forgotten it. I'll just throw this away. Thank you for keeping Taipei Metro clean. Do not eat, drink, or smoke in the Metro. Taipei 101 World Trade Center train departing in zero minutes. Someone might make a joke about the, uh, the other World Trade Center there, but I'm above that, okay? Just classy like that here. The first time I found this place, I felt like I had stumbled into a time portal. Old-fashioned houses and what looked like wartime bunkers overgrown with plants, right behind the tallest building in the country. I later realized it was an abandoned military housing village. Cool. I took pee here when I was 15, the night before my family moved away. I felt the need to imbue the end of my first ever relationship with meaning. I don't think he was very impressed. It sounds like a sex thing. I took a B here too after I realized I was gay. A significantly better evening. So that that's why that's why they're referring to the names as initials. That way you can make up the name and gender in your head. Like is this a lesbian or is this a male? Whatever, man. These places just hold so much, not just the memories, but also... Whoa. Damn, imagine having a gay experience on a military base. That would... Yeah, that wouldn't happen anywhere. Definitely not in America. Lead pasts. You want me? Damn, that's a tall building you got there. Where can I go? Oh, there's a yellow thing. And countless futures. <laughs> All this and fuck, I skipped nothing new. All of these memories have been with people I haven't spoken to in years. It's hard for me to feel very connected to anyone or anywhere these days. Whoa. Blah blah blah, completely different person than the one who had these experiences. The kid who grew up here feels far away. But space holds memory. Does it now? Maybe that's why I've always been so obsessed with maps. Huh? Is my body also a place? What would it mean to relate to my past selves the way a place does? Holding many futures and pasts at once. I'll try to hold them gently. I think I'm ready to go home. Real. 
Oh, I have to actually follow the lines. Mom? Welcome back. Triple exclamation point heart emoji. Gray? The color. No, okay, well, that's that. Crazy. Damn, should I play this in French? Ooh, using the full screen on off using F, I guess. To speak fish and chips. Okay. Oh, he just ran away. What a pussy. Cat. Did I just park up? Judas Saint Priest. <laughs> Finally, he left the Suez Company. Always understand grinding us to dust. Understaffed, they will only change when they are shit up to the neck. Anyway, now I'm fine. I found time to fix my bike. But we're not here for that. We got play with the band. Let's go fetch the others. Imin is already at the bar. Yeah, alright, I'm going to the bar then. Fuck, I have to talk to the guy? Have I just consumed him? Wow, nice mechanics here. Huh? These are good lyrics. Ooh, I need it there. To the toilet, I guess. VO. Mate, if you saw how it was in the nursing home, a death factory. So if you just quit, nice. So everyone in this band hates their jobs. Okay. What album was this? Or was it even an album? But I've seen this before. Gonna spiral and spiral and spiral. Wow, half life. Why am I looking at it? I get the reference. What the GTA map? Is this like Dwarf Fortress or some shit? This is Hanson, isn't it?
What does on-site telework technical unemployment mean? Wow, a room reference. That was Hanson. Uh, Hanson with an O? Come on now. Don't make me play Umbop in full. Fill up the minute to shit without me now. Let's leave. Here, take room 20 keys. Great lyrics. If you like the game, check out our band. No. Everyone is looking for the ocean. Everyone thinks the ocean will make them happy. Everyone knows the ocean listens to you and grants wishes. One must ask the ocean for nine days. But these days, the people are angry. The ocean hasn't responded. The ocean no longer grants wishes. Damn, too late. Salad days are over. Will you try? For you are young and so is the night. Cross the threshold, bruh. The ebb tide takes you in its jaw. Where you finally find the ocean. The ocean weeps. I will not listen again. I will not grant wishes again. I've been burned before, says the ocean. You decide to try again tomorrow. Maybe the ocean's just having a bad mood. ocean weeps. I always listen. I always help. But who helps the ocean? Who listens to the ocean? I will not grant wishes again. You decide to try again tomorrow because it's prehistoric times and you really have nothing else to do. See you looking different tonight. The ocean weeps yet again. People always say, I am strong, I am resilient. Is it why no one asks me if I am okay? I will not grant wishes again. Every day, slightly more emotional. You decide to try again tomorrow. The ocean weeps yet more. Why it's won't no one hand me thine tissue? You ask. Are you okay? I'm listening. The ocean doesn't respond. The ocean committed suicide yesterday. You decide to try again tomorrow. Lightning bolt time. <laughs> Zeus in the house. The ocean weeps. Why do you care? You only want your wish. Everyone only wants their wish. Is this why I exist? I will not grant wishes again. Man, this is birds probably just learn how to fly, I guess. The ocean weeps, you say. I am not here for a wish. I am here to feel. 
the sand, the wind, the water on the first night I came here. To die. The ocean weeps. You promised to visit tomorrow. The weather's settled. The ocean weeps, you ask why. I weep for we are the same, and I don't know how to help us. Yeah, more than a week of doing this, there's a boat in the background. Cool. The ocean weeps, the ocean tells you that it likes you being around. That its world is better with you around. That it wants to listen to you. Day 9. You promise to visit tomorrow. Ah, I think you leave more footprints. The ocean weeps, thanks for being around. You listened, and it helped. And I cried, and it helped, and you stayed. And it helped. And now, I will help. Make a wish. I will help. You wish to visit tomorrow. Okay, right, we're moving this guy around. Game, do you have any sounds? No, you don't. Okay. I guess I'll just slap something over this in post. So it's walking along this environment. Uh, I guess I can try to interact with things. Fast walking speed on, press again to toggle. Wing. Okay, we're zooming. Right, we've seen a squirrel, we've seen a dog. It's back at the beginning, isn't it? So, north of the tree? Do this. Yep. Get out of my garden. Zoop, he's gone. Ico, who? Oh, that'll be the dog that we saw. Wow, the whole cast. You're not doing your job. Is that arthritis? <laughs> Poor boy. Come on. Chicken. Stop button, select button. No, nothing. Uh, okay. Maybe you can go into the house. Go into the house then. Put your hand on my stomach. Feel it kicking. I'm gonna chop firewood. Again. It'll be a harsh winter. Ow, oh, just a doorbe. Can they not see me? Where's the baby? Hold still, I'm almost done. The dog senses something? Me, probably. Painting things, what's the matter with you? Just letting the chicken do its thing, huh? Uh, okay, the dog ran off to the left, but... Where is it now? He's chopping firewood? No, he's not chopping firewood. It's all lies. Okay, we'll imagine that made sense. Oh, does this finally go to a new region because you progressed the story? That's beginning, that's beginning, isn't it? Yeah, it's like it's progressed the seasons or something like that. Yeah, just in case you didn't get it. Is the dog. 
we'll just imagine it's the dog. As opposed to the chicken, the stumps iced. Can they see me now? We need food. I'll go. Take care of her. Okay. Picture of the dog. There's the squall. Imagine any place there's ice, we'd find the guy. Could potentially just be fishing anywhere. No, okay, maybe you've got to go through that screen to progress the seasons. Makes about as much sense as anything else. Is that blood? fall down the hole, did he? Maybe he swam upstream under ice. He can't interact with anything, so... Oi, I see you. go ahead. That's as high as we can go. Not very high. Okay, there is a hole. What's that got to do with the blood stain? I'm gonna be like, oh, he, he was bleeding, so he fell into a hole that he cut himself. If the squall's super evil and causing these deaths, things. Yeah, tis just a field. Oh no, oh no, the gravestone. Fertilizer is not going to save it. Don't worry, just spread it down. Okay, if we're done, I'm going hiking now. Don't forget the crossbow. Mom, relax, I'm not going far. Be back by dinner. You know how this usually goes. Oh no, she's been cursed by the squall. She's forgotten the crossbow. <gasps> He's just painting away. two chickens now. Right, so they got gravestone, even though he may have fallen into a hole? <laughs> That's like a ceremonial grave? At least Squall's gonna get us. What am I? I'm just some spirit going through time. You think? Oh, he's a ninja, but it's not that. They can't see me. No one talks to me. I'll travel to the edge of the world, come back with a thousand stories. Take this. It's dangerous. Oh my god, they said the fucking line. Thanks, Mom. Goodbye. Is that a cow? Yeah. Could be a horse. I want to say that's a pig. The ears are too weird. Still painting away. Picture of the husband, the dog, the child, and the, the older child. She didn't let the death of a dad get her down. And the squalls are grown up. Wow. 
isn't it crazy how like as time goes on people get older that's insane that's what this game story is basically yeah come on you can go down the hall autumn leaves or a wolf the crossbow stuck in it crossbow bolt oh no she's bleeding not dead yet you vulture wow someone's actually acknowledged me well you're just sitting there waiting to die so I guess we'll just continue on only two only two wow the tree came back Outdoor painting. What's coal? These trees never came back. All the trees take more than a year to grow back, don't they? Don't they now? Tend into a tree. The kids have gone as well. Now, the visual storytelling, it's like some kind of visual novel, you could say. She's there. Is that a boy? No? Okay, there is a visual. Smilers. I still don't understand what I am. Okay, we'll win her again. Oh, go down. Come on, they're just standing there, smiling like goofs. So I guess they've moved in here. Oh, she's downsized. Put your hand on my stomach. Feel it kicking. Heart emoji. Yep. Yeah. Then some text lines on screen just goes, bro, isn't that deep? Am I death? Yeah, that's what I was thinking. Time to go, isn't it? What would it have been like that winter if you had taken me instead? They want to know. Okay, let's go into the house. Is there anything here? Oh, who the fuck? Oh, so you can see what's happening. Okay, it's just him. It's plants and stuff. Okay. Just goes. Okay. Off to the logging area. Ah, uh, he feeds the squirrels. Right, so he, he's got a little greenhouse instead of a barn. I guess go this way because that's where the death-like figures are. 
question mark. We're going to go backwards through time here. She still leaves home, okay. He's, he went fishing, right? And then he fell into a hole or some silly shit like that. Or he went fishing and then got eaten by an animal. He's got the squall pinned in. Oh, that guy. To wrap up sometime soon. Basically, the twist has occurred. Can we get on with it? I'll travel to the edge of the world. Remember the way back. Keep a good map. Take this. Uh, yes. We're familiar with the line from Zelda. He's moving about. I guess that is him taking a second look back. Can I go into the house? Thanks. Is he crying? Right, still has one of her paintings up in the corner. You know, work in progress paintings. Eventually go back with the animals, I see. So essentially the whole twist of this, what if ninjas were actually death? Of which we've seen, so... So how many more seasons were there? Like three? The child's still here. He's learned the joy of plants somewhat. There he is. Come on, don't you want acorns? Okay, he's not crying. He's always got like this slightly lighter pixel underneath his eyes. I'm going for a hike. I'll go with you. Dad, relax, I'm not going far. Take the crossbow. Yeah, she, she's still dead, obviously. Shoo, shoo, shoo. Empty room? Oh, I guess they haven't had the baby yet. Mm -hmm. Yeah, dog is still kicking. You got any squirrels over on the screen? Has some nuts, little ones. Wait, who, who's this? This is me? Zoom. is ready. Is it though? Where'd they go? No one's eating food. No one's visibly doing anything. I feel robbed. Maybe they're at the tree? No. The tree is just growing. Oh, 
Oh yeah, it's it's not frozen anymore. I have to actually respect the rivers. Trees haven't been cut down yet. Planting the sampling. This is silly, it's not gonna survive the winter. We'll start building in the spring. Nothing's here. Oh. Bad dog. Don't be mad at him. It's part of his nature. She's hurt. Right, that's why the squirrels didn't like him. Don't bring that thing into the house. It's wild. What house? Better be cutting shit down. No? You bum. So they did go to the right. We, could we forward the timeline again, or are we just constantly going in reverse now? I think we've seen what it's like with him not dying. Oh, okay. Who's this? This younger her? Slightly older her? I, I can't tell. Maybe she's younger. Maybe she's got like colors in her hair or something. Represent by green because, of course, it's a Game Boy. Time to transition again. I don't tell what they're trying to do with her. <laughs> we can go two directions. Okay, I guess it just came back to the same place. Probably trudging up to the top of the mountain. This is as fast as we can go. This game really needs any music put to it, especially some some sad song. After you took him, I scripted in my mind what I'd say when I saw you again. <laughs> he doesn't want to hear it. You chose the wrong person. You should have taken me, not him. You're a fool. It felt wrong, but spring came, then summer, winter, and fall. Now I see your face. Mm hmm. You didn't really choose him, did you? Uh, no, he died. He just got got. Nature made the decision, not me. Thanks. Is there not a run button? Like, I guess running's just not a thing we're gonna do anymore. Fine, ignore her. Will I see my family again? <laughs> Doubt. Ah, uh, well, here is a member. I can't go left. Left has been locked down. to a dramatic scroll upwards. If you enjoyed this little game, please share it. Uh, okay, I guess I could do that.